Today I'm cutting up one of my favorite cuts of beef and that is the beef collar. And this particular beef collar is getting cut up from my freezer. Most of you know I had a fire here and it destroyed all of my equipment. So I'm gonna make do with what I have and that is a sawzall with a stainless steel blade. So I'm going to cut through this beef collar as far down as I can through the meat only and then I'll use the sawzall with the stainless steel blade to cut through the bone itself. This is by far the best tasting roast ever and it's perfect in a slow cooker, an instant pot, pressure cooker, you name it. Even if you want to roast it in a roasting pan and in the oven, delicious. It's one of my favorite cuts. So this is getting cut up from my personal freezer. And here I'm using the sawzall with the stainless steel blade to cut through that bone, the collar bone. And it doesn't take much. I do like to trim off the excess fat because I like to make my own tallow. Look at that, it's just stunning. This is grass fed, grass finished heritage beef. Not, no vaccines, no drugs, no corn, no soy, no wheat, just grass fed, grass finished. It's delicious. I love raising these cows, Dexter's and Lowline Angus and Herefords. They're so fun. Look at all that delicious fat for flavor. Incredible. Doesn't take long to do this. Less than three minutes and I cut up that whole collar and then I just packaged it and Put it in the freezer but uh, before I packaged it I did scrape all the bone dust off because you don't want to keep the bone dust on thank you for watching and until next time